Hey guys, I'm Tech from TechDriven and today I'm going to show you how to restore to factory or do a semi-reset of your HP OfficeJet Pro 6978. So this pretty much works across all 6900 series. So first let me show you how to do a, just restore. So let's say you get a printer from somebody or a job or somebody else and they have all the settings in the printer and you want to set up as new because you moved it somewhere else. For that, all you want to do is scroll down to this bottom, right here you have settings, press on it, go to printer maintenance, scroll all the way to the bottom, click restore, restore fact to factory defaults, or restore just the settings. However, if you're getting an error, for example, like bad inks or any type of error you just keeps popping up, you can do a semi hard reset, which most likely will help. To do that, there's actually a back button right here, currently not displaying. This is the one right here. So what you want to do is tap four to five times until you see a menu change. One, two, three, four, five. Once it does, click the support menu. From here, we can do diagnostics and also do reset menu. Press the reset menu, we can clear the country region just in case somebody else did it in other languages or you did it by accident. We can do a partial reset, which just pretty much just do a soft reset really. And semi full reset will pretty much clear most of it except for the page count. In order to do a hard reset, unfortunately, you would have to take it apart and remove the battery for quite some time so it really fully resets. Now the printer is resetting, it's going to take a little time. Once you wait for about 30 seconds, go ahead and click power. That will power on the printer and it will act like it was just new. It is common with HP to give you different results when you do a semi hard reset. So just in case the first time it didn't work to clearing your error or whatever, try it again. In some cases may take up to three times before it really resets and that usually clears the old error codes i hope this video was helpful please click like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this thank you